Hello, it's uh, Sandy here, and uh, I promised to give you updates about how my new book is coming along. It's going to be called Mind Calm, the modern day meditation technique that gives you peace with mind. And uh, so far, so good. Uh, this week, uh, I'm staying on the beautiful uh, Bainbridge Island, just off the coast of Seattle, where I found a little uh, uh, studio uh, which advertises itself as being ideal for writers. So we flew up the other day, and uh, we've been pretty much I've been pretty much writing ever since. So far, I've written about uh, six thousand words, and um, I wanted to tell you a little bit about how I go about uh, writing books. You know, a lot of people ask me, you know, how how do you write books? Uh, this is going to be my seventh book, and what I do is I make sure that I don't get overwhelmed by the thought of writing a book, and instead. I break it down into bite-sized chunks, and instead of just writing into a Word document, screeds and screeds of, of words, I actually format the page right from the get-go to the size uh, that I intend to have as the final version of the book, and I actually build the book as it's going to be uh, completed. So if you look at this, I don't know if you can see my page, but you'll see the first page has got the... Um, the praise for mind calm. Obviously, there's no praise there yet because I've not written the book. But that's where um, people, you know, authors and other people that you know are going to read this book are going to um, uh, give me their feedback, and they're going to hopefully write a nice testimonial. So that will go there. And then over here, you have the uh, the section where I list all the other books that I've written, uh, which is kind of a common thing to have. And then on the next page, I have the uh, title page, mind calm by me and then I, I, I really do mean it when I say I, I build the book as it's going to be finished um, I have the copyright page here which has got some space for the ISBN number when it arrives uh, and then scroll down further you find the uh, dedication page I don't know who to dedicate this book to we'll see what uh, comes to me once it's written and then we've got the contents page but uh, to be honest, that's uh, going to be censored right now, but I can assure you it's looking pretty good. And then if we scroll down further, we've got uh, the preface. I don't know if you can see the preface. From the chaos before the cam. Uh, a little play in words there. And then we go through to um, the foreword, which obviously isn't written yet. I've not decided who I'd, I'd, I'd like to have uh, write the foreword of this book, but uh, that will become clear. Then we've got the introduction. And then we go into the chapters. So chapter one, the hidden cause of a chaotic mind. And I've got a number of mind and body causes there. Then you've got the big benefits from uh, uh, mind cam. And then you go through to uh, a really cool chapter, which is called uh, the quick start. Get mind cam now. And that's where just in chapter three, we get people uh, having uh, much more uh, stillness between their ears uh, right from the get-go. And as you can see, the book is literally um, forming in front of our, my eyes and it's structured in a way that it's going to look like, hopefully, when it's printed and finished. So I find that that this is like the easiest way to um, to write books. I don't get overwhelmed by trying to write squeeze and squeeze of words, but in fact I just build it bit by bit and I can see it forming in front of my eyes. So I hope that little guide to... Uh, how I write my books um, is useful for you. Maybe you're thinking of writing a book yourself and I want you to know that um, it's possible for, for you if you really want to do it and especially if you break it down into bite-sized chunks and I find this sort of structure and format of writing books is a really, really easy and effective way to do it.